Good noonday, Cougars. I'm Julian Placencio, and you're watching Cougar Paws on the CBN. I'm Tierica Brown, and today is November 2016. You only have three more days until the end of the six weeks, so get your work done, Cougars. Key Club will be meeting this Thursday, November 3rd, during lunch in room 240. Please attend. Also, Key Clubbers, you need to bring your gifts for the Angel Tree Kids to Thursday's meeting. If you didn't get a paper, please bring $5 so we can make the gift baskets. If you have any questions, please see Miss Martin. The golf tournament scheduled for November 5th has been canceled. Participants can get their money back from whoever they gave the money to. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause. This will be our last time to repeat this student cancel announcement in case you missed it. The following teachers each have a Stutco jar in the room. The teacher who raises the most money will get a pie in the face at our prep rally on Friday. Students and teachers can donate until tomorrow. The teachers who agreed to participate are Ms. Rachels, Mrs. Bounds, Coach Murray, Mrs. Bryant, Mrs. Hutchings, Ms. Grissett, Coach Rock, Mrs. Babusa Lucas Grimsley, Mr. Richard, Mrs. Hundley, Mrs. Daw, Ms. Wisnecki, Mr. Ab Abbott, Ms. Doctor, Mr. Cook, Mr. Collins, Coach Freeman, Mrs. Burks, Mr. Chandler, Coach Pointer, Mr. Franklin, and Mr. Brown. Go by the rooms and donate a dollar. Who do you want to see get pied? Ms. Winnecki and Ms. Dahl are coaching prose poetry this year for UIL academic competition. They are looking for students who would like to read poetry or prose out loud to be on their team. Their meetings are Wednesday during lunch in Ms. Winnecki's room in 237. The Lady Cougar volleyball team continues their drive in the playoffs as they take on Birdville tonight at Thomas Coliseum in Birdville. Last week, we introduced you to a new feature for the holidays called the Greatest Gift Catalog Ever. Today, I'm bringing you a video about a very worthwhile charity called Skyball. Let's take a look. Hello, I'm Gary Sinise. I'd like to tell you about Skyball and the Air Power Foundation. Air Power is the nation's oldest military support organization, founded over a half century ago in Fort Worth to support Carswell Air Force Base. But after the terrorist attacks on 9-11, the mission of the Air Power Foundation changed because the needs of the men and women who wear the cloth of this country also changed. Many are now part-time warriors, members of the Reserves and National Guard. The sacrifices their families make when they are called to active duty are often debilitating. And when a loved one is lost in war, the result can be devastating for those back home. The Air Power Foundation's mission has grown from supporting the family readiness and unit welfare groups in North Texas to helping organizations around the country that support military families, wounded warriors, and veterans. Air Power often partners with American Airlines military and veterans initiatives. For example, Air Power is one of the largest supporters of Snowball Express, which hosts a four-day all-expense-paid series of events each December for children that have lost a parent in the war on terrorism. Air Power also supports the Gary Sinise Foundation, which is facilitating the building of homes for our nation's most severely wounded warriors. I invite you to help support the Air Power Foundation's mission by becoming a sponsor of a Skyball 10 to be held October 27th at Dallas-Fort Worth International Airport. Skyball is the major fundraiser that makes the Air Power mission possible. I'll be there performing with the Lieutenant Dan Band, joining thousands of other patriotic Americans gathered in the American Airlines hangar. We hope you'll join us. For more information about Skyball 10, visit airpowerfoundation.com. Thank you. Well, Cougars, that's it for today. We'd like to thank Audrey Panetta for providing signing for the deaf. I'm Julian Placencio. And I'm Tierica Brown. We want to wish you a good day and some good news.